I've decided I want to blow dry my hair today. Normally, I just let it air dry, but today, why not try something new? Plus, the way I see it, if I don't like it, I just hop back in the shower and wet my hair down and we're back at the beginning, so. Yeah, I gave up actually. I'm making another one because that one tasted so good. I find coloring therapeutic in a sense. And when I'm coloring, I'm not thinking about anything else. Especially when I'm feeling anxious, coloring really just soothes me because everything else just kind of fades to the back of my head. And this is what I'm focused on. I mean, I literally draw like a child. Like, I'm not even in the lines. But to me, that doesn't really matter. I kind of just color because I enjoy doing it, which I do for a lot of things. Like, I might not be the best at doing makeup, but I still enjoy doing it. And I might not be the best at interior designing, but I still enjoy decorating my room. I might not be the best at like fashion or designing outfits. And people tend to give up really easily. But if you enjoy doing something, if you enjoy it, do it. I've decided to take myself on an adventure because why not? You know, end of the day, I'm bored. We gotta get out of the house. We gotta do something. Got the dad shoes. Tell me why, when I go out in public to like go shopping, the outfit is cute, it's serving. But then when I go out for like a walk or for a drive, what is this? Random cut and acclaim t-shirt. These shorts I've literally been wearing all day because they're comfy. And dad shoes. Like, who's letting me out of the house like this? Because of my social anxiety, I couldn't talk at the beach. I was going to talk there, but there were a bunch of people. So that just didn't happen. Also, I got lost so many times. Like, I got lost a ridiculous amount of times. I thought I was going the right way. No, I, I wasn't. Not at all. Like, literally the opposite direction. At the beach, I was just thinking. Sometimes I feel like I constantly need to be doing stuff to be cool. Or not necessarily cool, but like a good person, like a fun person, an interesting person. If I'm not constantly doing fun things and going out, then I'm a failure. 
like I'm a boring person. Sometimes I even feel guilty. This really annoys me because I enjoy my quiet time and the simple little things in life. But when I see other people going out every single day in the like especially during the summer doing fun summery things, it just makes me feel like a lazy little b you know? Just because I'm not doing that, then but, I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. It's just, like, society has this pressure on us to always be going out, always having fun. And I know there's, like, all these trends romanticizing, like, little things now. But even when I'm hanging out with my peers, it feels like if when they ask me, like, Oh, what do you do? Like, how have you been? There's been nothing new. I've been working and I've been chilling at home and I'm going to see sunsets. That's about the extent of my life. I'm not complaining, but it's just annoying sometimes when you feel when I feel guilty. Cause I just cause I just wish I could be content doing that and not worry about people's expectations for what I should do. Yeah. Anyways. <coughs> breakfast or cooking for my snack because I got some free zucchini at work so I thought I would make myself some mm -hmm. dad got me playing last camps oh that is really random we got good at night are you up there I can only get up there oh so so climb the ladder I wish I could but is there a ladder or did you climb up the wall of the house no, we climbed the ladder. Oh, okay. I thought maybe he was like, turn it as fine again. <laughs> yeah, he said he already killed like two monster nests. So. Oh my gosh. And they kept on flying out against the spray them, so they oh, it's terrifying. Yeah. Well, we did not. It's like nine o'clock, and I make muffins, but we don't have any oil. I'm gonna wait for my mother to tell me what to do instead. Later. <laughs>